And yeah, that's another thing I hope on doing. I hope on creating a graphic novel for Sisters of Mercy. Now, y'all might be wondering, Witchy, do you have any experience with graphic novels? And I'd say yes, and um, I think that a lot of you already know that I do because of a nifty little language arts assignment that I did about maybe, frick, I can't remember, but it was sometime in 2019. I did post a speed paint. Oh, shit. I did post, like, a little time lapse of me talking about Van M. And a uh, little time lapse of me doing the first page. Um, thank the heavens my teacher was lenient, because I did not complete that project on time. Yeah, I wish I had spent less time on the rough draft, the more that I think of it. Oof, man. That was mentally exhausting, but fun. I want to do that again. Um, and, yeah, sorry that I'm saying the word um a lot. I just, I'm trying my best to keep talking. And I hope I've been succeeding, at least. And, yeah, hmm, should I color my stuff with, like, Sharpie or colored pencil. I can usually do colored pencil, so let's do like marker or something. Okay, so I don't really know what else to talk about other than like thank you guys so much for um all the support that I've gotten starting in like 2019 and how it grown to a channel of at least 41 subscribers by now because of you guys and how you've been finding out about my channel and subscribing to it and like your wonderful comments um question is no not question is the thing is that's what i meant to say um I remember talking about the copper regulations in one of my videos and how it might destroy my channel. But truth be told, I don't know if those regulations were put in place. Like, I don't know if the comments are disabled for my videos. I don't think they are, because they're only really disabled for my... Okay, I, I just realized something. You know about the comments being disabled for, like, um, made-for-kids stuff? Um, well, I'm, I only really saw that when I was at school and I was checking out YouTube and restricted mode was turned on and stuff. And that's when it really turned off the comments on all the videos that I set as not made-for-kids. Like, the Peacock one ain't meant for kids because of- not because of the content itself, but because of the game that it's connected with. Which, if you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. And because of how young the viewers are in my channel, I won't, um, talk about it. But I'll only say that that's the reason why I marked it as not for kids. Now, where in the world did I put green mark? Um, shoot. Yeah, let's just like cover it in with some black, I guess. Changing things up a little bit doesn't hurt. And, um, so, oh yeah, I finally know what I want to talk about. I want to talk about the, um, the graphic novel for Sisters of Mercy. I hope on posting the full thing page by page, um, on Instagram. And also, 
showing the completed prod and product to you guys, probably posting, um, like, a page at a time for you guys, like I do for my Instagram, probably. Yeah, um, I get worried, because usually when I plan, like, big projects on my own, they don't really come to fruition. <sighs> I'm kind of scared for that. I'll do my best to make sure it gets done. Yeah, I don't even know if I'm gonna include shading on this thing. I don't care if all this is, it's just sharpie with no shading. Yeah, and um, there's something twisty that happens in Sisters of Mercy where everything at the camp really goes wrong and such. And I think y'all are also at an advantage um, when it comes to my Instagram users as well. Because I haven't told my Instagram users about the whole Sisters of Mercy um graphic novel thingy sort of being horror-ish because like stuff goes awry at the camp so yeah I still care about y'all I'm giving y'all advantages um when it comes to knowing about the stuff that's in my original ideas like I do with my Instagram followers like I do post fan art on Instagram which, um, honestly might not be a big thing for you guys. Because I know that you guys probably want to see more original art and, like, no fan art. Because I don't really post fan art for, like, games and stuff on here. I have posted, like, some video that is not meant to be serious. And that is the Peacock video. Um... And I will be addressing it as the Peacock video. And I'm back at a straight in which I don't know what to talk about. So, I already talked about- oh shoot. This thing. Freaking thing. It's just coming in with a crayon. I'll just grab it. I don't care how much it clashes. I have this, I know this is only crazy art stuff, but this could slightly work. Yeah, I think I made this look extremely bad, <laughs> but I don't care. I'm just, I'm just doing what I want to. And also, oh yeah, I realized what I wanted to say to you guys. Yeah, um, I want to post mixed media stuff on here besides, like, the drawing medium. I was wondering if you guys want to see that, because, I mean, it's, it's not really something I want to do unless you guys want to see it. Like, mixing the drawing up with, like, something else. So, so mixed media is definitely something that I haven't really worked with but I do want to work with it more and um yeah that's all I want to shoot talk about and yeah this is drawing that I'm posting to you guys I'm thinking of like putting this in a filter it's like black and white colored and like sending this to my no not sending this and posting this on my Instagram account cuz I like black and white art and yeah that's all I want to say if you guys watch the end of the video congratulations if you didn't cuz this was kind of boring for you understandable let me know if you don't want to see this again or I mean 
or I might do this again, but this is just kind of special that I wanted to do. Anyways, I'm done. Um, drawing and yeah, this is Witchy Who signing off.